What a quick and easy way to get that old school 8-bit lo-fi chip tune kind of sound. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Bit Crusher here in GarageBand iOS. Let's go. Hi, my name is Pete. Welcome back to my five minute garage band tips. Let's dive in to the Bit Crusher. The Bit Crusher is one of the 10 free stop plugins that come included with Garage Band on your iPhone or your iPad. If you'd like to learn more about all of the other plugins, check the videos down in the description. To add the Bit Crusher plugin, first select the track you would like to add the plugin to and tap on the mixer icon in the top left corner. Now tap on plugins and EQ and hit the edit button. We can now hit the plus button, this green button to the left and choose the bit crusher it's the first one in our list of effects here under garage band effects if you don't have a free slot you may need to hit edit and delete an effect you don't want to open up a slot and then hit the green button to add your effect the bit crusher plugin is very simple to use it has just two options resolution and down sampling let's go through those now resolution allows you to control the bit depth of an individual track now GarageBand has a maximum bit depth of 24 bit 24 bit audio is pretty standard these days if you're seeing this as 16 bit you might have your GarageBand set to max out at 16 bit if you want to change that check out the video i have linked down in the description now dropping this from 24 to 16 bit won't really change the audio but once we bring it down to something like 8-bit you get a very different sound let's listen to this drum part at 16-bit first pretty cool right but if we want to crush this a little bit what if we drop this down to say 8-bit we're going to get a lower resolution sound and it's going to sound something like this Can you hear that we're getting less clarity in the sound? You're getting a little bit more fuzz in there. If we drop this down to say four bit, yeah, you guessed it. We're gonna get an even more old school kind of sound. Now, if you crush it too much, you're gonna get a sound like that. So you do need to be careful with the bit crusher, but you can get some pretty cool old school chip tune kind of sounds using the resolution setting here in the bit crusher. The down sampling setting allows you to change the sample rate. Now, every time we turn this up, it halves the sample rate. GarageBand by default has a 44.1 kilohertz sample rate. If we go to 2X, it goes down to 22, to 11, to five, you get the gist here. So if you want to really crush the sound, you can also reduce the sample rate. Let's listen to this with an 8-bit sound and a three times down sampling, which will have this down to 11 kilohertz. This is like old school PC stuff from the 90s. It sounds like this. And it instantly gives you that old school kind of vibe here. Let's listen again with the bit crusher off. It sounds like this. And with the bit crusher on, like this. So it really removes a lot of the quality because we're reducing not only the resolution, but the sample rate. If you'd like to learn more about bit depth, sample rate, and audio quality in general, check out the other other video I have down in the description. Now, because we're talking 8-bit chiptune sounds, yeah, let's try this on a synth because we can add this to any track we like, virtual tracks, audio tracks, whatever you want. Let's go to the bit crusher here and let's make this maybe just a 10-bit uh, and only a two times down sampling. Here it is without the bit crusher. And let's play this same synth sound with the bit crusher on. Hear how you just get a little bit more grit in there and what you can do is really dial this down and this one up and get some pretty drastic changes in your sounds. Not bad, hey? Yeah, old school, 80s, 8-bit. I love it. Confusion there you have it. The Bit Crusher effect here in GarageBand iOS, a very cool way to get some very old school sounds. If you'd like to learn more about creating, recording, and releasing in GarageBand, check the other videos in the description.